Unraveling the meaning of being a bootlicker. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive deep into the intricacies of the English language to help you understand and master it. Today, we're going to explore a rather colorful phrase, being a bootlicker. This term has rich connotations and is used in various contexts. So if you've ever come across it and wondered what it truly means, you're in the right place. Let's break it down together. The phrase, being a bootlicker, refers to someone who acts in an excessively subservient manner towards those in authority, often to gain favor or advantages. The imagery here is quite vivid. Think of someone so eager to please that they would metaphorically lick the boots of their superiors. This term is generally used in a derogatory sense, highlighting not just submission but an almost obsequious or sycophantic behavior. Understanding the origins of phrases can often help us grasp their full connotation. The term, bootlicker, has been around for centuries, rooted in the idea of showing extreme servility or submission. Historically, the act of literally cleaning someone's shoes or boots was a task for lower-ranking individuals or servants, symbolizing their lower social status. Over time, this concept evolved into a metaphor for flattery or servility towards those in power. Using the term, being a bootlicker, should be done with caution, as it carries a negative connotation. It's often used to criticize someone's behavior as overly submissive or fawning, particularly in a political, social, or workplace context. For example, if someone supports their boss's every decision without question, even if they believe those decisions are wrong, they might be called a bootlicker. It's important to note that while the term is effective for conveying disapproval of someone's behavior, it should be used judiciously to avoid offending or escalating situations unnecessarily. If you're looking for ways to express the idea of being a bootlicker, Without using the term itself, there are several synonyms and related phrases you can use. Sycophant, yes man, brown noser, flatterer, toady. Each of these terms has its own nuances, but they all revolve around the idea of excessive flattery or submission to authority. Understanding phrases like being a bootlicker not only enriches your vocabulary but also gives you insight into the cultural and social nuances of the English language. We hope this exploration has shed light on this colorful term and its usage. Remember, language is a powerful tool for expression, and knowing when and how to use such phrases can enhance your communication skills significantly. Thanks for watching. And we look forward to bringing you more insights into the fascinating world of English in our next video.